Hello everyone! Welcome to Zoe Home Inspired Living. I'm Marina. Today we're making macadamia chocolate chip cookies because I want to bring cookies to our upcoming picnic by the lake this coming weekend. So let's get started. These are what we're going to need. The macadamia roughly chopped chocolate chips, unsalted butter, two large eggs, vanilla extract, and flour, brown sugar, white sugars, and baking soda. First, we add the softened butter into the mixer and beat in until it's fluffy. Then we add the sugars. I usually use washed sugar or brown sugar. I added the sugar in batches as I continued to beat the butter and sugar mixture. Stop the mixer and scrape the bottom of the bowl to make sure that all the sugars are incorporated. Then we continue adding the sugar while beating in medium or high speed. Continue beating the mixture until it's light and fluffy. Now we add the egg one at a time while continuing to beat the mixture. At this point, we also add the vanilla extract. Now, we are going to prepare the dry ingredients. In a separate bowl, we measure the flour, the baking soda, and the salt. Whisk the mixture until fully incorporated. Add the dry ingredients in two batches while slowly beating. Beat in low speed until just incorporated. Then add the remaining flour mixture. The cookie dough is very stiff at this point. Remove from the mixer and continue mixing with a spatula or a wooden spoon. 
Add the chocolate chips in batches while continuing to mix until they are incorporated. Now we add in the roughly chopped macadamia nuts. Continue to mix gently until all the nuts are incorporated. Now cover the bowl with the cling wrap and chill the dough in the refrigerator for one hour. Use an ice cream scooper to transfer the dough into the baking sheet. We use two baking sheets for this recipe. Now they are ready to pop into the oven. We bake at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 to 12 minutes. And here they are, hot out of the oven and smelling like heaven. The aroma of freshly baked cookies is a no-fail way to call the kids into the kitchen and find out what is going on. It's been rather a tiring and busy day. I'm doing photography for my new um, teacups for uploading on my online store and also baking these cookies. But my heart is filled with gratitude to the Lord for enabling me to be able to do all these things every day, which bring me so much joy. Now it's time to have quiet time and tea. Join me. Thank you for spending your time with me this afternoon and please like, share and subscribe to my channel if you have not yet. Thank you and God bless.